guys. We're heading over towards Surfside right now. We're gonna go help Clint do a private property tow. He's got a uh, Infinity, a two-door Infinity uh, G35, and it's kind of lowered. Got big aftermarket exhaust and stuff, and he says he can't get it loaded up, so he's asking for a flatbed. So we are heading over there to see if we can't get it loaded. Thanks for watching, guys. judging by all the sand. Get it at a real steep angle here. No key. How's it going? Oh yeah, I get it done. <laughs> so, How you doing? Pretty good. Alright. Guess, uh, what do you think? Probably get it from the front. I get it. I just put my uh, I, I got some ramps and stuff. I put my ramps under it. Uh, get it up. Uh, yeah, what? I uh, I don't think these have lock steering. Well, it might have lock steering. Does it? It locks. Okay. Okay. The good thing is, out there. Yeah. And they're unlocked. <laughs> well, at least I can uh if you I mean if you can are you gonna are you gonna winch it over or Okay I can I can do that. Yeah I can I'll winch it over. Right So I guess Clint didn't want to didn't want to uh, dolly it or anything. I'll try to get over as close as I can. These freezers, so I'm pretty straight with it. So we might have us a, uh, a G35 up for sale soon, is what you're saying? That's what the person has. Yeah. They got him one, but it's all hidden. I don't know why, but I've always wanted one of these things. I just want the wheels. It has really nice wheels on it. It really will drive. Yeah. yeah. What? That, that sucker got the adapters to it, too. Does it? <laughs> 
sure does. No, I doubt it. Right? Swap out. I didn't see nothing. Let me see if this one. There's not bad. Sand on it. And you just left the beach, huh? That's what it looked like. It looked like they uh, might have got sand all up in that starter. Starter up. Might be. And it's not like this thing's low or anything, you know? Heck no. I've always had Mustangs and stuff, and people always ask, you gonna come out to the beach? I'm like, heck no, I'm not bringing this thing. It just kind of keeps the cable centered. See how it, that way it doesn't mess my drum up.
since we have access to the inside of it. Get it in the neutral. We're getting close to that exhaust. Oh, Inch or so. It's probably gonna catch. <laughs> oh no, the bottom of the got much. You got a quarter inch. Quarter inch on that one. Nice wheels. I know. Too nice to be leaving it on some car that abandoned, you know? Like, right. leave that thing in the wrong parking lot, it ain't gonna have wheels for very long. <laughs> I wish I knew how to kick it into neutral. <laughs> little screwdriver, it's all you need. It is, that's what I say, it's, it's real low. It's real low. How long has it been sitting here? Since last night? <laughs> it just turned up in the middle of the night or what? No, like, I was working, it was maybe almost about seven o'clock last night. And they just dumped it off and left? They left it, out of the truck, took off, didn't even come in. Hey, we're leaving the car, we'll come back to it tomorrow. Right. Didn't leave a number or nothing. Yeah, I mean, they're lost. Yeah, they can, they come back looking for it. You know where it's at. It'll be at Campbell. Campbell, yep, right there at Angleton. Oh, in Angleton? Yeah. Y'all not in Freeport no more? We do have a yard in Freeport. It's full? Well, it's not full, just most of the stuff like this would end up taking Angleton. Oh. Just that's where, you know, most that's where all of our dispatchers and stuff are at, so. They want to come and release it. It's just it's right there in the, in the yard. right there in the yard. Now to go all the way to Freeport to release it, you know.
Got her loaded up. All right, she's headed to the yard. Thank God, have a good day. You too, bud. Got her loaded up. I'm gonna be headed to the yard. I'll be over there in just a second. Thanks for watching, guys. Right, we are pulling back to the Angleton yard now. Find a spot for us to unload this thing. I put it next to this Ultima. We're gonna have uh, Sari coming to uh, unload also. She's got a uh, lowered truck that uh, missing a wheel, so we'll probably end up having to help her unload that. There's an open spot it looks like, like right up there on the other side of my truck. You should be able to kind of just back in right there in front of my truck. Can't really see it. The other side is missing the, the wheel entirely. Probably end up having to jack it up and reset that block. missing wheel there. Just throw it all up there. I need to grab my screwdriver so I can get this thing in neutral. Grab my winch remote. Throw them off in there, it'd be fine. If you can throw it loose up there, it'd be fine. Just toss it up there. Watch yourself, puppy. What's up, puppy? What's up, puppy? Get this thing into neutral. Yeah. The wheels are slightly turned that way, so I left myself at kind of an angle. I need this. Going to need my 
dates for the exhaust. There was a big block of wood somewhere around here. I have that one big one. Is that big enough? Yeah, but I wouldn't leave that on your truck. Um, if you if if we want, I have my small aluminum jack. I'll get it. We can lift that up. Put one of my good skates on it. Uh, hey, what about that green jack? The big one? The big big one? The big one like this. I mean, if you want to, I wouldn't leave it in the yard. You know, in case we need it. Like to get that. We could. I don't know how well it's going to want to roll. Because um, that, that, the bumper is on the ground when it's coming off. But if we can just get it slid down to the edge of the bed and then just set it on the ground, block the that other tire to stop it from moving, and then just walk out from underneath it. And then if nothing on it's going to drag because it's going to be sitting in one spot. You know what I mean? Give me like a couple of seconds. I'll have this one unhooked. I'll come over and help you. lift up on the bed you can make space right there that makes life see if you go down you know yeah I'm always on the ground getting all nasty yeah things. you can lift up on it as long as you know it's as long as you know it's in park yeah. and you're not it's not gonna just roll off the bed and crunch the bumper then it's fine <laughs> 